I'm being thing. forcibly removed from the building again of a public lobby. So. so if you want to take off that gun and badge, I'm happy to scrap with you one day. Sir, please, is there anything I can do, sir, please? Don't do this to my wife, man. You don't know what you're doing to my family, man. Please, I'm begging. I'm literally begging. Where am I going to put my feet? Sir, I'm begging you, please. Please. You want to do it, You let's do it. Let me know, buddy. That is not a crime, and you're telling me to get out of my vehicle. Do you know where Lieutenant Mingus is right now? So, no, he's not in the building? I don't know. I'm not. What do you know? Okay, I don't want that man taking my picture. Uh, Why sir, don't you take him out of here? Sir, you hit me. I'm a you hit now. me. Okay, sir, okay now you take my picture, then. I don't know you. I'm not telling you nothing else until I find out who's driving that vehicle. You not a supervisor, bro. I need somebody higher than you right now. I didn't break the law. I'm not going to be found guilty of anything. This is a waste of time. If you guys want to know who I am, I'll tell you who I am. Okay. You want to know what I'm doing here? I'll tell you what I'm doing here. Uh, if you didn't know, I went to the police academy and they kicked me out. That's my purse! I don't know you! Spit me on my face right now! She spit in my face! Please, sir, please don't make me sleep in jail. I'm begging you. We're sir, not criminals! Please. They're going to make me sleep in jail. Why? Sir, please. Please, dude, please. Oh, my God, don't do that to him. You guys don't know what you're doing to me, man. Why? Why are you saying right here? Oh, man. You guys really don't know what you're doing to my life with this, man. Seriously, please. We really haven't been getting a lot of support from the community. Um, You know, we need help getting hotels. Uh, we've pretty much got the food and gas covered, but if there's any way anyone can help out in any way, guys, the hotels, uh, the fees have really been killing us. Um, you know, we don't make a, a million dollars. We don't make a whole lot of money. But if there's any way anyone can help out, please, we couldn't do it without you guys. Today's video takes us to Fort Worth, Texas. Matter of fact, the Tarrant County Jail located there. Lovely. Manuel Mata, oh, now from what I can understand from Carolina to Fort Worth, he was sentenced to six months in jail and a total of $4,000 in fines, but then she said something about an additional 180 days in jail, which is another six months, I don't know, but they're going to try to raise the bail money to get him out, I think they need a total of $9,000 bail money because he's going to appeal the case yeah, I don't see them raising $9,000 in cash. Not for Manuel. Nah. Anyway, um, this is a 30-minute uh, video. I just took about 10 minutes of it or so. So sit back, watch, and <laughs> enjoy. So today we had, um, yesterday and today we had trial for Manuel. One of the, one of the ones was one that's not online right now. You guys didn't see it. I think maybe you might have saw it live. But it's where one of the officers just jumped him. He was stepping back and the officer jumped him and then ripped his arms up, hurt his arm. He got found guilty, right? Yeah. Guilty. Twice. Twice. Guilty and guilty for resisting arrest because he put his knee in the door when he was asking for the supervisor. Now you might be asking, where's his lawyer? Well, we didn't know where his lawyer was. His lawyer was sitting there. So this is the idiot they're referring to. I always call him Manuel, uh, Manuel, all right, whatever, I don't care. Yeah, another toothless fraudster, huh? Well, anyway, yeah, he's going away for a while. He was found guilty. Oh, dearie me. Let's listen to what she has to say. By the way, it's Carolina Fort Worth. But he wasn't very effective. He was at the snack machine. I hope he's not watching in my live right now. He probably is. But he went... He was terrible, so let's see who's on here. We got, um, oh, I can't read it. I want to wear my glasses. Oh, true, true, uh, true North Transparency. Lenny's in here. The okay. second. But here's my thing. He didn't portray him as Mata. Right. Had he came out and said, he is a community activist, an advocate. Mata wasn't filming for no reason. He had a reason to film. Oh, yes, indeed. He had a reason to film for clicks and views. Oh, mucho dollar, okay? He need mucho dollar. Now, if you believe that the YouTube channel is for anything else except for an income stream, then you're just as stupid as a fraudator.
the 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 defense or the prosecution was saying that he was uh, creating conflict, but that's not what Manuel was doing. And the, he and was standing on the sidewalk. Our lawyer and he got six months for standing on the sidewalk. Yeah, we, and yeah, they I, tried I, to I, double six months his bond. Six months. So he got okay. Uh, the other one where he was where he started to walk and the the the, um, the cop left walked a hundred feet up to him. Remember that one where he said, "Can I go or not?" Mm -hmm. And he took two steps forward and stopped. And then the the, the guy came all the way up, like for a hundred feet or mm -hmm. yeah. He got guilty on that one too. Just in case for anybody who may not know, might be new to the channel, this is Carolina Fort Worth in the sunglasses. And she's no choir girl. Oh, no. She's been arrested multiple times because she hangs out with Manuel. And she hangs out with Harvey Jailbird, and Cody Low Roller. Yeah, they're a group. They all get arrested together in Dallas-Fort Worth. But let's continue. I want to hear if uh, Manuel got any more jail time besides the six months. And, and the thing is, is that our, the lawyer did not interject anything. Didn't He didn't say anything. He didn't... He didn't ask the right questions um, to the to the cops that were up on the stand. Like, for instance, in the first case, mm -hmm. the first case, the first case that happened is that there were two. Okay, what happened was what happened was they had a boy detained. They had a boy detained on the wall. All right, mm -hmm. people walking by everywhere. Right, Mata comes by with his scooter and his camera, and the police officer focuses in on Mata and tells Mata, "Hey, man, you better back up." The whole time, putting gloves on. Right, mm -hmm. Manuel's backing up. And he steps back two or three more steps, and the guy jumps him and arrests him. Well, now, that's not exactly how it happened, Carolina. But it doesn't really matter because he took a ride anyway, right? Yeah, he moves back when he feels like moving back. You know, it's like ten minutes after the cop asked him. Yeah, he moved back. But what the lawyer did not ask, the, there was like a lady in a wheelchair that was next to the guy that was detained. There's another guy in a lounge chair that was next to the guy that was detained. There are people walking by. Manuel was not even, those people were closer than what Manuel was. But yet he still, they were saying he was interfering with the, with the, uh, with the incident. Now there were because two cops. No yeah. <laughs> but there were two cops. So the lawyer did say, well, you left, you went 30 feet away, made a phone call, and you left the guy. And you went inside to solicit a trespass, and you left the guy. Mm -hmm. So why why did you have to leave? What was so what what was wrong with how you leaving? How did he interfere? Yeah, how did In he which interfere? He didn't. Because you walked up to Mata. He this is a thumbnail of the arrest of Manny the Misfit. I call him. Yeah, you see the cop standing right there, pointing. He moved back, moved back, and he never did. Manny never did. So yes, the cop walked up to him and arrested him. You see, Frederick's always twist the story around. They don't know what the hell they're talking about. He walked up on Mata. And so for some reason the the I have the jury papers right here, the instructions to the jury. Instructions, it says if he, he only spoke and didn't physically interfere, you can you have to find him not guilty. He didn't physically interfere. He didn't even really talk that much. And they didn't, they didn't read the instructions and, and find the right thing. So, so he got chart, he got 180 days for that one and a $2,000 fine on each. That was a power trip though. The, the, the lawyer sucked. The lawyer did not intercede. The lawyer didn't like help the lawyer. The lawyer just really dropped the ball. The lawyer should have put him up on the stand. Oh yeah, right. Could you imagine putting that illiterate jack wagon up on the stand in a court of law? Hey man, hey man, hey man, because that's all he says is hey man, and he doesn't know how to talk. He yells all the time. He yells. Yeah, I just can't imagine him up, up on the stand. This is another thumbnail, though, from when he got arrested. Yeah, it was a mess, and they were definitely interfering with the police investigation. Because he didn't get to explain why he does this stuff, you know. They showed a body cam footage of him going to the to the jail where he just, you know, the whole way there, he's like, oh, I got your qualified immunity. Da -da -da -da. You guys are going to be in trouble for this. I'm going to sue all y'all. You're, you're breaking my, my rights. No one cared about his rights being broken. This cared that he interfered, which he did not. But the lawyer should have been interrupting and saying stuff, and he didn't. He just sat there like a bump on a log. Well, that's what happens when you don't have any money and you have to take a public defender. Here he is arrested again. I told you the boy's been in cuffs so many times, I lost track. 
I got at least six thumbnails of him in cuffs. Uh, you know what? I think he's the fall guy, though. I really do. I think that uh, Harvey Jailbird in Carolina set him up for arrest. The poor guy. So, oh, and they recommended, they told the jury, and the guy did not even interrupt. Manuel's got all these other things that he's done that are bad. All these other things. No, he, he said that he was, he's been breaking the law, or he feels like he's above the law since, or his entire life. I was like, wow. Now, okay, now let me. Jesus. Oh, let me go back now that I'm remembering it. Cause I what, forget. Did, what did he do, really? Yeah, nothing. <laughs> I'm gonna cut it off there, good people. But it sounds like Manuel got six months in jail and a total of four thousand dollars in fines, which couldn't happen to a nicer guy. Yeah, was that gonna stop him from frauding? Oh, only for six months, and then when he gets out, he'd be right back at it again. His mama must be so proud of him. What do you think? Well, at any rate, if you enjoy watching idiots, imbeciles, and morons on my channel, like Manuel, please subscribe. <laughs> As always, thanks so much for stopping by, Manuel. You'll find out why they call it the Slammer Now, boy. Cheers to that. Oh, you assaulted me. I did. So you assaulted me. She assaulted me. Oh, no. Yo, you're racist. Katie. Racist. Oh, that's a hate crime. You're being disorderly. Call the police. Call the police. Call the police. I'm not sitting down. I refuse to sit down. I refuse. Big tough guy. Big tough guy. Big tough guy. What are you going to do about it? Nothing. Nothing. You can come try to make me. You're welcome to try to make me. Take a swing. Take a swing. What is the reason for calling the officers here? You'll go to jail, bro. Go ahead, put Stop your hands on me. me bro. Put your hands on me. Really, no reason I'm really, to have I'm really, I'm really unhappy that somebody did this to me. I'm going to arrest you for trespassing yeah, in a minute. On um, public property? Yeah. We're asking you to leave and you're not leaving. That's trespassing. She's, jealous. She's right in my face, guys. You, you just assaulted me, ma'am. You can't t come up and touch me like that. You don't have permission to film me in any space. I don't need permission to yes, you record do. you in public, man. Actually, no, that's the do. law. Salami hala handula, alu akbar, haknuikan da kra, ula wala fufatai.